Liam Byrne is connected to two firearm conspiracy plots. A court has heard. The 43-year-old appeared at London's Old Bailey via video link from prison as well as his brother-in-law Thomas Bomber Kavanagh on Monday. The pair's close associate, Peter Petter Keating, was also named in relation to the case. They are currently locked up in HMP Beaumarsh, where Byrne is on remand following his extradition from Spain last month. They are facing charges in relation to the supply and acquisition of firearms, and central to the case is encrypted messages from Encrocha. Following a hack by authorities who other men from Liverpool, Daniel McLaughlin, 36, and 37-year-old Sean Kent are also charged. Prosecuting barrister Max Baines told the court that the case relates to two plots. He said, this is related to two firearms conspiracies connected by a common defendant. That being Mr. Byrne, Byrne is accused of conspiring with McLaughlin and others to possess firearms and ammunition on dates between April 29th and May 28, 2020. While he also is facing a rap for conspiring with Jack Cavanaugh and Keating to possess firearms and ammunition between January 1st, 2020 and June 3rd, 2021. In relation to Kent, charges he faces in Manchester are closely connected to the main firearms conspiracy. Baines added there are overlapping messages which are relied on, and a clear nexus for the cases to be joined but expects Burns' legal team to object. The court also heard that Bomber Kavanaugh's plans to have an application brought forward to have charges thrown out look to have fallen away. Thomas Bombers, an Irish criminal and a senior member of the Kinahan Organized Crime Group, Founded by Christy Kinahan, he was one of the first targets of the Criminal Assets Bureau CAB when it was established, and is currently in jail serving a 21-year sentence. He is a member of the Byrne Organized Crime Group, a branch of the Kinahan Crime Organization originally led by Christy Kinahan. It was then led by Freddie Thompson, then by Kavanaugh's brother-in-law Liam Byrne. In 1990 he was found guilty of a firearms offense that led to a seven-year term in an Irish prison. In July 1999 CAB secured an order against Kavanaugh for £106,000 for unpaid taxes on income. The Bureau said it was derived from criminal activity. His house on Nocturia Avenue has been seized. In October 2000 he was one of a group of people who assaulted a witness in the four courts who had testified against Liam Byrne. In 2016 he attended the funeral of his brother-in-law David Byrne, who had been shot dead as part of the Hutchkinahan feud. He moved to the UK after 2000 and settled in Tamworth. Christy Kinahan had previously settled in this town when he first left Ireland. He has his own gang based in Birmingham. Like his brother-in-law, he runs a luxury car dealership in the UK. Guard I believe that the dealership is a front for laundering drug money and that cars have been exchanged between criminal-owned companies as payment for drugs. It also allows a group of criminals in England and Ireland to have access to luxury cars, which they do not own and cannot be seized from them. In 2017 he was given a 16-month suspended sentence for failing to declare taxable income and supplying false payslips to secure a mortgage. In September 2019 he was jailed at Stoke-on-Trent Crown Court for three years for possessing a 10,000-volt stun gun disguised as a torch, along with other weaponry found in his house. During the trial it emerged that an Osman warning had been issued to him in early 2018. On the 12th of January 2019 Kavanaugh was arrested at Birmingham Airport as he returned from a holiday in Mexico. In July 2020 Thomas Kavanaugh along with Gary Vicuri and Daniel Canning pleaded guilty to drugs and money laundering offenses at Ipswich Crown Court. In March 2020 court sentenced Kavanaugh. Canning was jailed for 21 years, 20 years, and 19 years 6 months respectively. The judge said that all three of the men had played a leading role in the criminal organization. He also said that they could be released on license by which time Kavanaugh will be 65. The deputy director of the National Crime Agency said that they had dismantled the Kinahan operation in the UK and that the proceeds of crime investigation into the assets and financing of the gang continued. In August 2023 Kavanaugh and two other men were charged with firearms offenses in the UK. They appeared in Westminster Magistrates Court and were remanded to appear at the Old Bailey.
After listening to snippets of the trial, it is now come clear that Bomber has gave firearms to the NCA for a lighter sentence, but sources say this has backfired on him and that it has only made it worse for him and the rest of the gang. The accused men are also facing charges in relation to perverting the course of justice. This is in relation to possessing firearms, hiding them before telling the National Crime Agency where they were in a bid to get Kavanaugh a reduced sentence for drug trafficking. The 11 guns were seized by police in Ireland in May 2021. Byrne and Kavanaugh are expected to be arraigned on March 1st, their next court appearance, as the judge said she would adhere in the matter. To allow for disclosure of evidence and time for all of the defendants oppose the application, the trial date has been set for September 2nd and may last up to six weeks. Byrne, wearing a black t-shirt, and sat with his arms folded, and Kavanaugh in a navy Nike top and gray tracksuit bottoms. Only addressed the court to confirm their names. The young man from Tamworth in the West Midlands remains in custody in Spain awaiting extradition. Byrne was also lifted on an arrest warrant in Mallorca before he was returned to England in December.